हेलो फ्रेंड्स कैसे आप सब आशा करता हूँ ठीक है मैं भी ठीक हूँ वेलकम टू माय चैनल डिमापुर बंगाली रिएक्ट्स और मेरा नाम है किशोर था फ्रेंड्स आप लोग सब जानते होंगे न्यूज में भी देखते होंगे कि जब से पीएम मोदी जो है लक्षद्वीप आइलैंड पे गए अपना फोटो खिंचवाया स्कूबा डाइविंग किया तब से मोलडीव का जो पतलून है वो गीली हो गई और मोलडीव जा पहुंचा चाइना के गोद में तो बहुत कुछ पोलिटिकली हो रहा है लेकिन इसी बीच देखिए फॉरेनर्स लोग जो टूरिस्ट है जो ट्रेवलर्स है जो लोग मतलब मॉलडीव जाना पसंद करते हैं वो लोग ढूंढ ढूंढ के अभी मतलब लक्षद्वीप आइलैंड का जो वीडियो है वो देखने का कोशिश कर रहा है कि लक्षद्वीप आइलैंड आखिर में कैसा है क्योंकि उन लोगों को सबको पता है कि मॉलडीव है क्या मॉलडीव में क्या दिखता है मॉलडीव में क्या दिखाई दे रहा है और इंडियन टूरिस्ट जो है वो अट्रैक्ट हुए थे बॉलीवुड से बॉलीवुड बार बार जाके दिखाया था मॉलडीव ऐसा है मॉलडीव वैसा है तो अभी जब बॉलीवुड स्टार लोग लक्षद्वीप को प्रमोट कर रहे हैं तो मतलब फॉरेन टूरिस्ट जो है वो लोग देखना चाहते हैं कि लक्षद्वीप आखिर में है कैसा तो मैं आज आप लोगों को एक रिएक्शन वीडियो के ऊपर भी रिएक्शन दिखाऊंगा तो आप लोग देखिए कि फॉरेन टूरिस्ट लोग मतलब क्या डिसाइड करते हैं रिएक्शन वीडियो देख के जो लोग ऑलरेडी लक्षद्वीप आईलैंड में जो लोग ट्रेवल करके गए है उन लोगों का वीडियो देख के फॉरन टूरिस्ट लोग क्या डिसीजन लेते हैं उसके ऊपर है तो जो लोग नए हैं चैनल में जल्द से जल्द चैनल को सब्सक्राइब कर लीजिए साथ साथ बेल को भी प्रेस कर लीजिए ताकि आपको मेरा हर आने वाला वीडियो का नोटिफिकेशन मिलता रहे तो चलिए बिना देर करते हुए रिएक्शन वीडियो स्टार्ट करते हैं और रिएक्शन वीडियो स्टार्ट होता है अब Bara we you have an address from my sock central european point of view in today's video i am super duper excited so i have seen uh, some photos of uh, of modi in lakshadweep uh which i understand there might be something a little something something going between maldives and lakshadweep and i was wondering to go to maldives because maldives is supposed to go apparently like the sea level will just drown it so but i feel like maybe even with the indian visa i could just go lakshadweep so I decided to review a video on Lakshadi by Ivana and but before we jump into the video please like this video and click on the subscribe button and turn on the notification thank you so much for your support okay i am super duper duper excited i want to know what it looks like and uh, it will i think very much inform my decision so without further ado let's kick this off In this video we're visiting one of the most beautiful places I have ever seen in my life and it's right here in India. Lakshadweep is a protected conservation area which means the access to this gorgeous place is limited but as you'll see it's not that difficult to go here if you know how. If you're interested in how to get a permit for Lakshadweep, where to stay, what the food is like and last but definitely not least if it's expensive, make sure to keep on watching until the end. All the basic wow. information is covered in this video. with the first What? impressions of luxury in india good morning from kochi airport my name is ivana and i am from bangalore and right next to me is the beautiful Hi. kritika introduce yourself my love hi i'm kritika i'm also a travel blogger like ivana and we are super excited because we are here by far the most pretty airport i've ever landed and can you believe there's even a herb garden How cute is that? The first thing that's getting checked is our negative RT-PCR test and our permit. Because Lakshadweep is a restricted area, getting a permit on your own can be ex extremely tedious. I've looked into it in the past and gave up because it was too much fuss to sort on my own. So here's how to do this. The tour operator Go Lakshadweep who brought us here takes care of the permit process like a pro. All you have to do is give them a few documents and there's no more permit stress for you. We have officially reached the most beautiful paradise in India. Look behind me. It is a little bit raining it is gloomy and yet the water is still so beautifully blue i can't this is so beautiful actually it's it's more of an aqua color or more turquoise i can't like all the shades of blue on this blue monday <laughs> it is monday today Now on to the next thing to sort how to get around lakshadweep the main mode of transportation between the islands is by boat In order to get to the boat, Go Lakshadweep arranged a transfer for us and we get to catch the first few glimpses of that turquoise water from the ground. 
After a quick drive, we arrive at a dock where our boat is waiting to transport us to Bangaram Island, one of the in total 36 islands in Lakshadweep. As for the population, only 10 of the 36 islands are inhabited, oh, wow. and of those 10, just 6 are open for tourism. Oh. I'll elaborate a bit more on Bangaram Island when we reach, but for now, it's important to know a return boat ride from Agati to Bangaram Island will cost about 6,000 rupees is bursting from joy. I can't believe India has such a beautiful paradise, and I feel so incredibly grateful to share this hidden gem with you. The water is crystal clear, it's impeccably clean, and I just can't wait to explore every nook and corner of this wow. place that pretty much resembles heaven for me. You guys, this is unreal. This is unreal. made it to the beautiful Bangaram Island and there's only one resort here which is called the Bangaram Resort. It is a government-owned resort. You can only get here if you have a proper permit and usually you have to reserve this place months in advance. Sounds tedious? It can be if you decide to do everything yourself but we are here by invitation of so so beautiful. I really can't wait for the sun to come out and for the weather to clear up a little bit because I think this is going to be insane and it's it's going to blow wow. all of our minds. If you want all of the information about gold travels, I have linked them down in the description below. The easiest way to book through them and to request the prices and packages and those kind of things is to send them a WhatsApp message. They have people stand by on chat um, throughout the day. I know, I know. So it will be super, super easy for you to book a trip here, which is mm -hmm. usually, honestly, not wow. an easy place to get to and not an easy place you know, to, to get a spot, but it is like a paradise in india truly 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 incredible in india i can't get over how beautiful this place is after a refreshing welcome drink it's time to see where we'll be staying for the next few days so let's see what the bangaram island resort looks like wow i mean Surrounded by so much tropical greenery, the amount of rooms in Bangaram Island Resort is limited. Hence, if you want to go here, make sure to go fast because this place sells out like crazy. Despite the weather being quite gloomy, it is actually really nice here and warm. So I changed into something a little bit more com comfortable and it is time to check out our room which is behind me over here. Seeing the room for the first time, I'm actually quite impressed. The stories I'd heard of Lakshadweep all spoke of very humble, rustic rooms, but this is really a great room. It's spacious, clean, and there's AC, which you'll definitely need when the sun comes out. The bathroom is simple, and you do need to know the water smells of sulfur, but with the natural beauty outside, this is all nothing to be worried about. It's a pretty sweet life over here. Okay, so to me... It looks very basic, but I don't think I would mind at all. Most beautiful beach paradises where I've ever been have been one Jamaica and two Curacao. Lakshadweep is is right up there with those top three. Um, I I honestly can't choose which place is better. The one thing that Lakshadweep uh, has an advantage of is they have amazing, amazing fresh home-cooked Indian food here and yeah in that sense luxury we wins hands down with the food but in terms of like top beach Caribbean destinations in the world luxury is right up there I am baffled nothing less than baffled to see how incredible this place is we also had the privilege to experience a suite for a night and this is absolutely perfect if you're coming here with your whole family now enough about the accommodation let's check out what we all want to see how many shades of blue can you distinguish in these phenomenal luxury tropical waters this is purely purely incredible and the fact that it's untouched is what makes it I think so appealing that it's not commercial. Maybe because of that, the rooms are perhaps not as nice, but have that. Like, this is incredible. Can you believe this is the Arabian Sea? Can you imagine yourself here? What would you do if you were us? Frankly, we just couldn't stop jumping for joy because of witnessing all this beauty. 
and we couldn't wait to jump in. All these new impressions make you hungry, so let's see if the food is any good too. There's only one common restaurant in the resort and all the food is served here. In your accommodation price, three meals are included per day and of course the chai breaks. Every day there is a humble but extremely delicious buffet of an Indian bread, free papad, two types of rice, two sabzi or veggie dishes and a different variety of dal. For the non-veg people, there will be a non-veg dish available separately. The food was so yummy, fresh and almost felt like we were in an Ayurveda resort. After four days of this buffet, I really felt nourished and hugged from the inside. With a full tummy, the best thing to do is go for a walk and explore more of the natural wonders here. In the next episode, when the sun comes out you'll be able to see much more how to work variety of dal. For the non-veg people, there will be a non-veg dish available separately. The food was so yummy, fresh, and almost felt like we were in an Ayurveda resort. After four days of this buffet, I really felt nourished and hugged from the inside. With a full tummy, the best thing to do is go for a walk and explore more of the natural wonders here. In the next episode, when the sun comes out, you'll be able to see much more how the water sparkles. We chose to stay in Bangaram Resort, but with Go Lakshadweep, you can also opt for the Samudra a cruise package where they'll take you around three different islands in five days. I'll elaborate more on that in the next episode when we visit Dinakara Island, but just know there are multiple packages available and Go Luxury will take care of any logistic stress for you. I don't know where you came from. I just can't. I think this is incredible. This is, I'm even wanting to go for a cruise. This is cool because I feel like there will not be much to do. So I think that the cruise could be... First day of Luxury made all my wildest dreams come true. I expected it to be beautiful, but in real life, it's breathtaking. Uh -huh. And even though the weather would make us wait to clear up, Kritika and me chose to celebrate life in the best way possible here. Basically, run. Oh. <laughs> That's a good oh. shot. Is it really deep? Is it cold? It's, no, it's <laughs> This reminds me of what people do in Ibiza. Uh, but then you have women um, with poplars going this way to the sea just to masquerade themselves. Rain. Wear your swimsuit and get inside the water. Yeah! Your turn now. What are your first impressions of Lakshadweep based on this video? Let me know down. Man, this is incredible. Like you could have seen from, it's my, obviously my first time seeing that, but I, it does get me excited. It just gets me super excited. Like I've, as, as I said during the video, it felt, yes, yeah, this is underdeveloped. It felt basic. But man, it's beautiful. Like, I would not mind. Like, I don't have to have the most luxurious whatever. But this is so, so gorgeous. And the fact that it's just, let's say, one hotel. And you can just, you know, chill by yourself. And I love the idea that you can actually hop, you know, get on a cruise. And, you know, see all the islands. This is incredible. Like, you know, because it feels like you can be on the, it's like when people, let's say, go to Maldives, right? I mean, obviously Maldives in terms of the, the, the hats and I had friends that been there. It's just so crazy expensive as well. Um, it's, it's obviously gorgeous, uh, but it's, it's so commercial. And I think a lot of people are looking to find something no commercial, something more natural. I feel like this kind of fits the bill. So I'm definitely looking into figuring out how am I getting my butt over there? But I think I would want to go on a cruise. I think I would be bored because I think it's the same with Maldives. You go for a couple of days, there is absolutely nothing to do, just the beautiful water, but nothing else. Uh, and I think with a cruise, you can just go around and, and see a few more places. So, wow. I mean, incredible, you guys. I had no idea this is in India, but uh, that is something when I'm going to India and it's going to happen this year. <laughs> um, that has to be one i thought that i would go go up but then i discovered this one so yeah wow um 
I mean, it is it is incredible. And I wonder what do you guys think? Like, I, are you well aware? I, I understand that now Lakshadeep is a bit more impressed because what's happening with Maldives and that Modi has actually said or the government had mentioned that they will invest into that. Uh, but uh, I just wonder if you have been aware and if any of you by any chance are planning or have been. And if you have been, if you have any other tips for me, please do let me know in the comments. So, what do you guys think about this video? This video is a very interesting video. So, how is it like this fun to use? How is it like Lakshadip Island? How is it like this? 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 वो लोग सभी जांच कर रहे हैं क्योंकि अभी वो लोग लक्षद्वीप आइलैंड में विजिट करना चाहते हैं और बाहर का देशों में से इज़राइल पहला देश है जिसने बोला कि वो लोग लक्षद्वीप का जो वाटर है उसको वो लोग पीने के लायक बना के छोड़ेंगे डिसलाइनिटी करेंगे उन लोगों का टेक्नोलॉजी डिसलाइनिटी का जो है वो वर्ल्ड में पैटर्न है फेमस है तो अभी वो लोग इसराइल में कल से ही काम करना शुरू कर दिया इसराइल ने ये वाटर डिसलाइनिटी करने का ये हो गया पहला बात सेकंड बात टाटा ग्रुप ऑफ इंडस्ट्री जो है टाटा रिसोर्ट्स का जो होटल ताज जो फेमस होटल है उसका वो लोगों ने टाटा ग्रुप ने डिसाइड किया कि वो लोग वैसा ही मतलब होटल आपका लक्षद्वीप आइलैंड में बनाना शुरू कर रहे हैं तो है ना सोने पे सुहागा अभी इज माई ट्रिप मेक माई ट्रिप जितना भी मतलब ट्रेवल पोर्टल है वो लोग क्या कर रहे हैं वो मॉलडीव का जितना भी फ्लाइट का और होटल रिसोर्ट का बुकिंग है सब बंद कर दे रहे हैं कोई भी बुकिंग वो लोग नहीं दे रहे हैं इनफैक्ट वो लोग जो लक्षद्वीप आइलैंड का पैकेजेस खोल के बैठे हैं तो आप लोगों को बहुत ही अच्छा लगा होगा ये वीडियो देखे ये जानकारी सुन के तो कैसा लगा आप लोगों को ये रिएक्शन वीडियो अगर ये वीडियो अच्छा लगा है तो आप लोग वीडियो को लाइक शेयर सब्सक्राइब करना मत भूलिएगा फिर से मिलेंगे एक नया वीडियो के साथ में तब तक के लिए थैंक यू वेरी मच एंड बाय बाय